Hi and welcome to this DCP web tutorial. In today's tutorial I'm going to show you how to add green screen content to a video clip using Adobe Premiere Pro. Okay so on my desktop I've got this folder and inside this folder I've got these two video clips. I downloaded them from Pixabay so I'll put links to those in the YouTube description. Let's go ahead and open up Premiere Pro and we'll drag and drop those clips into the media pool here. Let's take the alarm clock video clip and drag that onto the timeline and then we'll take the green screen content and drag that above so it needs to sit above right just like this let's click on that green screen content and then go to the effects over here and type in ultra and we were looking for the ultra key here let's drag and drop that onto the green screen content now we can simply go to the key color and click on the eyedropper tool and click on the green here and that will remove all of the green screen content now we can see the presence overlay Let's move those presents using the position tool here and let's just move them to the side a little bit. And there's a few little tweaks that you can do in here to improve the uh, the green screen. It's done it pretty well, but you're in the output, in the settings here, default we can set it to relaxed or we can set it to aggressive. And aggressive will just get rid of some of these sort of darker edges around the, um, the presence, yeah? So if I switch between them, put it back to default, You'll kind of see like these darker sort of lines around it and if we set it back to aggressive it will kind of get rid of those and make it look a bit more uh, natural you could say you can also go into the mat cleanup and inside the choke you can adjust that as well just to adjust it slightly i always give it a little bit just a tiny bit and you can soften the edges as well just to blur them out slightly so it looks a little bit more like that object is within this scene so let's click um, let's just drag the timeline here slightly and we'll click the play button and now we can see those presents falling over just like this so you can experiment with that um, sometimes you need to just play around with the settings just to get it just right uh, but apart from that that's pretty much how you use the green screen function the ultra key in Adobe Premiere Pro so let's minimize this that's the end of this tutorial. I hope you find it useful and I look forward to seeing you in the next DCP web tutorial.